Welcome to Around the World Channel. Singer Trey Songs arrested at Arrowhead Stadium during Chiefs, Bills playoff game, NBC News. R and Amp. B artist Trey Songs was arrested at Arrowhead Stadium in Kansas City, Missouri, during an NFL playoff game between the Chiefs and the Buffalo Bills, authorities said Monday. Source. Aaron Rodgers wants a new contract, NBC Sports. Packers quarterback Aaron Rodgers was sending a message to the team with his post-game comments after Sunday's loss to the Buccaneers in the NFC Championship. Denver Nuggets Jamal Murray ejected after hitting Dallas Mavericks Tim Hardaway Jr. in groin, ESPN. Dallas, Denver Nuggets guard Jamal Murray was ejected after what appeared to be an intentional shot to the groin area of the Dallas Mavericks Tim Hardaway Jr. Harvey Weinstein's bankruptcy judge confirms sexual misconduct settlement, report, Fox News. Harvey Weinstein's sexual misconduct settlement has reportedly been approved by the judge overseeing his company's bankruptcy proceedings. COVID. Quarantine hotel plans set to be announced, BBC News. The government is expected to announce that some travellers coming to England will have to quarantine in hotels, over concerns about new COVID variants. Tom Brady's former Patriots teammates praise him following NFC Championship win. This man is all the goats, Fox News. Tom Brady is back in the Super Bowl, but this time he's leading the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. Prior to joining Tampa Bay, Brady was the ringleader for the New England Patriots over a 20-year stretch. Who is Brittany Galvin, the bachelor, woman accused of being an escort? New York Post. The Bachelor franchise is no stranger to odd jobs, but this alleged profession is sure to get fans talking. Biden tells CNN Trump's impeachment trial has to happen, CNN. CNN, President Joe Biden on Monday offered his most extensive comments since taking office on President Donald Trump's impeachment trial, telling CNN I think it has to happen. Watchdog to examine whether Justice Department helped Trump effort to overturn election, the New York Times. Mr. Perry, a member of the pro-Trump, hardline Freedom Caucus, said in a statement to a Pennsylvania public radio affiliate that he spoke with Mr. Trump and Mr. Clark about election fraud claims. Biden ends military's transgender ban, part of broad discrimination fight, the New York Times. At the Pentagon, officials said they welcomed the action, and indicated that the department would begin implementing it quickly. Please, like this video and subscribe to the channel if you want to stay tuned for upcoming news.